Northern Stargazer The Northern Stargazer can be found on the eastern shores of the United States. The fish can be found at depths of up to 120 feet. It is capable of producing electric discharges up to 50 volts. The blackish-brown body of the northern stargazer has white spots on the neck and back. It has a mouth that faces upwards which allows it to ambush prey while it remains well camouflaged in the sandy bottoms of the coastal waters. The northern stargazer is also able to generate electricity due to the presence of electric organs in the orbitee. The electric shock generated by the fish is used in hunting for prey and in self-defense. Electric rays There are about 69 species of electric rays. The most distinguishing feature of these fish is their ability to produce electric discharges that are used to stun their prey or as a mechanism of defense. The rays are capable of producing electric discharges ranging from 8 to 220 volts. The best known members of the electric rays are those belonging to the torpedo genus. The electric rays lives at a depth of 3,000 feet. They are slow-moving creatures that use their tails to propel themselves forward instead of their pectoral fins. These rays feed on small fish and vertebrates and use electricity generated by them to stun and capture the prey. The ancient Greeks would use the electricity generated by these rays to numb pain caused during surgeries and childbirth. As per the accounts of an ancient Roman physician, the electrical properties of the torpedo fish were used for treating gout and headaches. Black Ghost Knife Fish The Black Ghost Knife Fish lives in South America including the Amazon Basin. The fish is grows to a maximum length of about 50 centimeters. It is capable of producing electric discharges up to 550 volts. The Black Ghost Knife Fish is also nocturnal and it possesses an electric organ, and electroreceptors are distributed all over its body. Thus, it is among the few animals that can both produce and sense electricity. The fish uses its electrogenic and electrosensing capabilities to locate insect larvae, its primary food. The fish use these electrical properties to communicate with each other and also for electrolocation. Electric Catfish the electric catfish are capable of generating electric shocks of up to 350 volts. The electric catfish are found in the tropical regions of Africa and the Nile River. They are nocturnal and carnivorous. They feed on other fishes, fish eggs, detritus, and invertebrates with the food habit varying by species. The electric catfish use electric shock as a means to stun their prey. The electric catfish is the only catfish group that has electrogenic organs that are well developed. Interestingly, ancient Egyptians would utilize the electric shock generating the ability of the electric catfish to treat arthritis pain. For this purpose, only small-sized fishes were used since the larger ones are capable of generating painful shocks. Mural paintings of ancient Egypt depicting these fish are thus common. Electric eel the electric eel is the only species in the electrophorus genus and is known for its ability to produce electricity. The fish live in the Amazon and Orinoco freshwater river basins in South America. It has a square mouth at the end of the snout. The most interesting feature of the electric eel is the three pairs of abdominal organs that generate electricity. With the help of these organs, the fish can generate both high and low voltage electricity. It is capable of producing electric discharges up to 850 volts. The electric producing capacity of the electric eel is usually utilized to stun the prey of the species. Once the eel detects its prey, the brain transmits a signal via the nervous system to the electric organs.